Hey guys, how's it going? DUJ2 here and welcome back to Kingdom Hearts Union Cross. First and most importantly, we're hitting that Lux boost and we're going to start raiding. But, okay, let's talk about this. Get new avatar parts in the latest set of Union Cross quests starting midnight. Plus, daily jewel quest and VIP magic rooms. Alright, um, a couple of things I want to talk about in this. And I'm sorry, but my throat just... <clears throat> Man, feels like it's going to die. Okay, um, so first of all, I am not exactly <laughs> loving uh, Union Cross being one week long. Um, I'm having... Oh, my goodness. I'm having a really hard time um, remembering <laughs> to do Union Cross. Especially with this week, which has been like kind of like, you know, all about raiding and everything. Um... I'm I'm liking I like I like Union Cross I like multiplayer, um, I think that's one of the things that I'm going to be talking with my party the most about, about us figuring times to do multiplayer together. Now, in a week like this where it's not only Lux, you know, like the Lux grind, Lux rankings, and everything like that, and Union Cross for one week, I kind of think that it would be okay for them to make these Union Cross two weeks long not just one week now i understand why they're doing them one week at a time i mean that was one of the things we were complaining about i mean i did too i was i was saying you know um it takes too long to get the coins it's too much of a grind it's not really fun um the mechanics of multiplayer are actually very good they're actually quite impressive <laughs> but um the actual gameplay was just it felt too much of a grind so i can understand why they increase the amount of coins that we get they made the actual events and the instances that we go into different more difficult etc etc um and at the same time they reduce the amount of time that, it, that union crosses around but in weeks like this um i kind of feel like you know it would be cool if they didn't you know if they just um ooh, second chance cool um if they were to I kind of feel it would be cool if they were to just extend it, you know, like when we have a week like this, with we have a lot of content coming out, um, someone like me who I think I've done one or two, I'm going to be grinding Union Cross pretty much the rest of tonight. Um, so yeah, next thing, the daily challenge event for jewels, thank goodness that's coming back, that's really awesome. Um, 1400 jewels and that's going to really help for a lot of people who want to do an extra pull or something so that's going to be really cool and lastly VIP rooms okay let's talk about VIP rooms um, hmm VIP rooms <sighs> so The difficulty of the global game is at a certain limit, right? Um, or a certain level, I would say. I feel that we are at that level and it's not something that we need to look down on or or just, you know, be unhappy about, to be honest. Um, because there are certain things in the game that enable us to... I'm, I'm trying to look for chemos, but it's not popping up. Wait, can, am I not going to get it if I do this? Sorry, I know you guys can't see what I'm doing. Okay, well, let's see if I do this. Um, so the difficulty at where at which we are in the game right now and how much we've been progressed because of the amount of banners, events, and everything that's been coming out, um, it does feel like Square Enix is trying to advance us in the game. Um, but... Okay, how can I say this? <sighs> for the amount of medals that we have and we are getting right now it would be both for just for the amount of medals we have both banner and event the high score challenges and everything i believe that we are very much lacking on brooms uh for example um, all the high score challenge medals. I know a lot of people who were not able to guilt Illustrated Donald, and he's pretty awesome. Um, and we're not talking traits yet. We're going to talk traits in a, few, in a little bit. But um, right now, because of what we have, I do believe 
that brooms should be more accessible in the game. Now, something we've been talking about for a long time, and I've been talking about for months actually, was when we were talking about, oh, how should brooms be introduced into our game? One of the things that I said that I thought would be very positive for them to do is if they were to release two brooms a month. Uh, sorry, two Fantasia and Mickey Bees a month, okay? So, whether through events or through um, challenges or in, or in uh, Coliseum or any anywhere anywhere in the game, there could be, let's say, 10 brooms that every that most players would be access would be, have access to um and that wouldn't be like putting fantasia mickey bees or brooms behind boards or behind vip boards or a vip wall like this um so if they wanted to release a couple of more fantasia mickey bees a month like that sure whatever but i do feel that our game is at a point where we should be we should have more access to Fantasia Mickey Bees. Um, right now, I'm sitting on three, and I'm about to get another one. And to be perfect, well, with this VIP, to be perfectly honest, I really would like to go ahead and um, I really would like to go ahead and guilt uh, uh, Sriracha Genie, uh, Jafar Genie. Um, and this is where the next problem comes into play. I really want to have him guilted because I really want a reverse power. Um, one cost metal that I can put a Lux, well, he already has Lux on, uh, so I can do for a Lux rating because I really do want to start getting more involved in Lux rating uh, and Lux grinding. But looking at this and looking at the fact that we'd have, you know, a certain, a very limited number of rooms, which honestly, they are starting to come a little faster, but they are mostly still behind a little bit of a paywall. Um, you know, it's it's a little discouraging in that sense. And then the next thing that comes into play, and something that I really, really hope that Square Enix addresses soon, is the trait uh, fact. Um, the fact that even if I were to guilt Sriracha Genie right now, using Fantasia Mickey Bees, he doesn't have a trait. And he has no chance of getting a trait, unless we do another reprint banner. Um, so, in an instant like that, I really do feel that, you know what? they need to address that by giving us some sort of new fantasia mickey c you know uh or whatever or they can do a fantasia donald or fantasia i don't know what they can do they can do a yen said b i think a yen said b would be really cool a uh, really cool metal um to be able to reroll traits or something or something that can give us more of a trait a chance for traits and i say that for people like me who are very 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 hung up on traits um and i i really do i am very much focused on traits and thinking how can i use this metal if i don't have a trait on it um so things like that would be really great yeah i know fantasia's Donald. fantasia's Donald would be cool i think fantasia's Donald would be cool uh <laughs> blasphemy <laughs> uh anyway let's see if there's anything else right now uh now that i've said my piece about that Okay, there doesn't seem to be anything else. Okay, so what I would like to do actually tonight, and unfortunately I do not have a lot that I can do, but I do have a couple of gift cards. Um, this is awesome. I mean, this is via, this is brooms. I mean, this is brooms, and this could really give someone. So I'm going to do a couple of giveaways tonight. We're going to do two gift cards. I have one Android and one iTunes. Um, unfortunately, I don't have any more. I need to go and get some more soon. But I'm going to do that, and we're going to hope that we do see something else in uh, the update tonight. Oh, Fantasia Goofy. <laughs> Man. You gotta wonder. Okay, I, I know this is off topic, but this is fun to talk about. Okay, so uh, Go uh, sorry, Mickey was the, the source's apprentice, right? He was an apprentice to Yen Sid. So you've got to wonder in that world, I mean... Donald could Donald and Goofy could have been like farmers or stable hands or something. You, you know what I mean? Well, actually, wouldn't it be awesome if Donald was already a sorcerer too? That'd be awesome. I don't know. I don't know. That's just me talking. I I, I love I love talking about stuff like that and theorizing things like that it would be so cool and that's the beauty of of the Disney World too. There's it's so expandable and there's so much opportunity. Um, but anyway, 
let's finish this here, guys. I'm going to keep raiding. Uh, I love the auto raid uh, button, if you guys didn't know. I'm actually going to do a video very soon talking about that because there's a lot of things that I want to talk about the auto raid and what it can potentially do for us. Anyway, we're going to leave it there, guys. Thank you very much for watching. As always, I am DUJ2. Let's check one more time to see if there's anything else. Nothing else in the updates. Um, all right, so I'm really, I'm going to be working. I'm, I'm actually going to be streaming if you guys want to come to the stream. Uh, I'm going to be streaming pretty much KHUX and Union Cross after this raid hour all the way until the update. I Hopefully, I can get enough coins. I also need to get enough coins to complete these boards, um, which I'm at 7,000 and we need about 10,000 to complete these boards. So I have quite a bit of work ahead of me tonight. And I just realized that I know that it says I'm, I'm streaming in a different category. So let me change that right now. Uh, and thank you very much for watching, guys. And I will see you guys next time. Or I guess in the update video. See ya.